We begin with the very latest developments on a deadly weekend crash in New Bedford. While friends and relatives mourn the loss of the young victim, the man accused of causing this accident prepares for his day in court. I'm a news reporter Andrew Adamson has details now live with the mobile newsroom. Andrew? Yeah, Daniel and Patrick, we're hearing from the victim's emotional father. He's calling for justice after his son was killed in what he's calling a senseless accident. The victim is 20 year old Juan Macho Gonzalez. He was killed in a car crash at the corner of Russell and Purchase Streets in New Bedford around 3 a.m. Sunday morning. New Bedford police say 33 year old Manuel Ribeiro ran a stop sign, hit Gonzalez's car, killing him instantly, and fled the scene. Police tell Eyewitness News Ribeiro tried to ditch his Close and nearly $4,000 a few blocks away when he was arrested. Rivera's charges include vehicular homicide, fleeing the scene, and driving with a suspended license. The victim's father says he wants Rivera to pay for the crimes. I hope he goes to jail because if he doesn't, by on camera, I'm going to say that's going to be his best place, it's in jail. And Rivera will appear here at New Bedford District Court coming up later today for his arraignment. We're going to have all the details from that coming up later on. For now, live with Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Andrew Adamson, Eyewitness News.